To get all the relevant information for analytics purposes for our space agency, you have to work with different systems like success factors, S4HANA, field class, and so on. But SAP Analytics Cloud brings them together in one dashboarding environment. And you don't have to be a data scientist to find the information and correlations that you're looking for. Imagine I'm responsible for our workforce setup in the space agency and the budget in Europe. I regularly check my dashboards for my main KPIs. So let's move there. Let's have a look. We go into my analytics tile, and here we can see my main dash dashboard. So I can see, well, that looks quite good. Operating revenues are constantly increasing, so I'm quite happy. But let me look at operating expenses as well. Ah, OK, those are increasing too. Well, what about the profit? If we go into the profit, then my picture changes, because obviously we seem to have a steady decline. Now, we should dig a bit more deeper and not only visualize the data, what we've done till now, but use a bit more intelligence. Let me use some smart assist features in SAP Analytics Cloud, because they help us to unveil hidden insights, detect outliers, key influencers, and do some forecasting. Let's use them here. I would like to forecast this value and see what's happening. By using the automatic forecasting, we are using HANA Advanced Predictive Libraries, and we are going to see um, how the time series data is analyzed according to trends and cycles. And you can see there's um, a value set and some lower and upper confidence bounds of what might happen. And well, I really should take some action because obviously we see that the forecast shows a decreasing trend. So let's dive now into this. Let me go into Europe and drill into this continent in our countries here. And there we can see, well, in Spain, we have quite some significant operating expenses. What I would like to use now is smart insights, because this under the hood uses powerful machine learning algorithms. And this is going to uncover the top contributors of the selected value here. So it shows the highest contribution of the data point being analyzed. So what we can see, not a big surprise, research and development for an aerospace company is quite significant, but then I would have expected the crews come in sec second, so paying your salary, Björn. But obviously, we have public relations coming in second, which is a bit awkward, right? Public relations usually doesn't use a lot of mis uh, material or assets, so it must be people that cause the costs here. To figure out what is happening here and to get a deeper insight, I would like to use a very cool feature which is called Search to Insight. And Search to Insight brings conversational artificial intelligence into the game. So I can ask a question in natural language about what I'm interested in. So let me say I want to understand um, public relations, FTE, by employment level. And you can see, well, not a big surprise, typically that's full-time employees and a couple of contingent workers supporting them. We've seen that specifically in Spain, we seem to be going out of bounds with our expenses. So let me look what is special about Spain. And we already get some input help here. And you can then see, well, in Spain, we have quite a lot of contingent workers on this position. And of course, contingent workers are paid on an hourly basis. So that might be a very relevant cost factor. Luckily, we are in Spain today, so I can follow up with the team directly. To avoid this in the future and to get all the information at hand, I can create a dashboard like this, which will give me an overview of the employment status in the different countries and even show a very nice map that indicates where do we have um, which situations on the first side. And of course, I can have some more ratios in here like managerial employees compared to non-managerial roles, which might have an impact on our cost factors as well. So you have seen that SAP Analytics Cloud helps you to manage your business more effectively by getting the right information at hand and making it easy to ask questions about our space agency, even in natural language. So we can be sure we hire the crew in our space agency that we want to have and that we stay on track with revenue and profit.